Hey everybody, Ry here, and I get this question all the time. Ryan, what software do you use? Well, until recently, the answer to that question was none. But I have yet to discover Jungle Scout, which is a Chrome app that allows me to really take my research to the next level. And the research pertaining to finding products that I can private label and sell. So for this example, I'm going to use uh, soda can lids or soda can caps. Something that reserves the fizz in the soda can um, for carbonated uh, products. So this app again is, or, or this extension, is something that I've recently discovered and I absolutely love it. I'm going to show you how I use it to discover new products and take my search to the next level. So here I have beverage can resealer. For $4.50, you get one reseller to make sure that your carbonated drinks stay carbonated for as long as possible. So I want to know more about this product and, pro you know, possibly if I'm able to private label it and make it a winner. So I go ahead and just simply hit the JS icon in the corner right of my Chrome browser. And I get several other products that are similar to it. And by clicking the top, and what I do is I'm actually, again, by clicking the top, I can categorize it by the price from lowest to highest. Click it again, it's from highest to lowest. And this helps me to quickly organize exactly, you know, what I'm looking at. You could also uh, organize it by category, rank, sales, and estimated revenue. Now, this comes in handy for several reasons. One, everyone's so obsessed with the BSR, the best-selling rank. I'm able to determine which product has the best rank, and I'll know why. For example, it looks like here the best-seller rank is going to be Soda Pop Tops, one dozen. And I'm guessing it's the top because for only $6, you're getting 12 tops. So I can go ahead and take a look at that. I also have an idea of what the competition is or the workload is going to be for me to outbeat them. For example, they have a four star rating and they only have 113 reviews. Me personally, I feel very confident with any product under 200 reviews. And that's just me personally. So it gives you an overview of as a product if this is something you want to go ahead and enter. And it looks like the, the product with the most reviews has 405 and it's ranking about 14,000 in the kitchen and dining. Another thing I've yet uh, I've come to discover is categories make a difference. For example, this is ranking 6,900, but it's in the sports and outdoor. This might actually be the market or the category I want to enter in if I want to take them down. I know that sounds really uh, probably um, competitive, but <laughs> that's what we're doing. You know, it, it, we're taking them down. So I'm going to go ahead and click Soda Pop Tops One Dozen, and I'm keeping in mind that I don't want to um, necessarily rank in the kitchen like everyone else, but sports and outdoors. So it looks like there may be some leverage there. Looking at this listing, it looks like it's a pretty simple listing. I think I could beat them. They don't have very many pictures. They have only 113 reviews. And what I like to do with any product is look at the reviews and check out those negative reviews. See what people are saying. Now there are 12 soda tops for $5.95. Now, you're probably thinking, well, I can't make any profit with that amount, Ryan. No, you probably can't. So what you might consider doing is actually bundling yours or increasing the quantity that you allow. Or, by looking at the customer reviews, having a better quality product and in your description actually listing exactly why your product is unlike many others like it. So, looking at this negative feedback, it says, ideal was good, materials and color were too. Wanted to like it, but it just didn't create a seal with the top of soda can. Shipping and refund were handled properly. So it looks like it's really not doing what it's saying, uh, according to this customer here. It's not sealing it. So this other customer does not seal the can very well. Soda goes flat in a short time. Hmm. Going to the next review, these tops do a minimum job at best. I have used them on several different soda cans with the same effect. They do not hold the fizz. So with this product, and it seems like very recent reviews, look, December 2014, so only about three months ago, people are saying that this product just isn't holding in the fizz. 
Well, with that being said, maybe we can research another product very much like it that has raves about the fizz being held in and we can sell that in dozens instead of this quality. We could also make a better guarantee that if your fizz isn't held as suggested or as promised, we'll refund you and you get to keep the goods, something like that. So it's about making your offer better, making a better product, and you can rank. So for this example, using JS, what I was able to do was determine... Oh, this isn't the product page. That's another thing about JS, guys. You have to pull up from the product page. I'm pulling from the product review page. That's a no-no. You don't do that. So, again, going back to the actual product page and then hitting JS, <laughs> like you're supposed to, I'm able to determine that this product may be a little more competitive than I wish, but that's in the kitchen and dining niche. What I like to do is go ahead and pull it up for sports and outdoors. Oops, didn't mean to open that again. For sports and outdoors, try to rank in there. I'd also like to make sure I have a topper that's actually going to hold the fit. So I might look at other toppers as well and see exactly what it might be that's helping hold that fit. So I'm getting a product that hold, that's holding the fit. Again, looking at this product listing, it doesn't look like it's anything too special. There's not too many pictures, and the product description is pretty bland. Yet, it rates 6900 in sports and outdoors. So that's what I want to go ahead in. If I were to get this product, I want to make sure I have a higher quality product and rank in sports and outdoors, not in kitchen and dining, because it may be a little more competitive. Okay, guys, I hope that you've enjoyed this video, and I hope that you consider getting the software or the Chrome extension, JS which is Jungle Scout. It's been a great addition to my research process and really helping me determine whether I want to enter into a market simply based on the data that it supplies. It's a great asset and I suggest anyone who's serious about doing their own private label products using it. Hope that you've enjoyed this video and I'm signing out.